fatally impaled by fish. This Tuesday, salons and spas nationwide are offering free services to cancer survivors. It's a program that all started in Highland Park by a woman with a will to help. I was going for a checkup in my oncologist's office, and when I was leaving, I saw the notice for Cancer Survivor Beauty and Support Day. Liz Grabscheid is a breast cancer survivor. Years ago, she booked her first appointment here at Femme Day Spa in Highland Park, the first salon to offer free services to cancer survivors annually on the first Tuesday of June. It makes your day. It makes all the other things that you're going through just go away for that one day. Barbara Padgett is the founder of Cancer Survivor Beauty and Support Day. She came up with the idea more than a decade ago. I was watching TV and a travel, someone who does all the travel information said, today I'm not going to talk about traveling. I'm going to tell you about a spa I went to in Northern California where so many of their clients were diagnosed with cancer that they decided to have a spa day. And I, I looked at the TV and I went, I can do that. She sure did. 4,300 salons nationwide now participate. I made up a chart of the 50 states. And like I was running for office, I would say, well, we got this state. Paget has teamed up with Grey Clips, Regis, and beauty schools, Paul Mitchell, Pivot Point, Empire, the Milan Institute, and Milady Cosmetology. The list is endless. When someone emails me and they say, but there isn't one where I live, I say, yes. Find a few places, call them, tell them about it, get me the information, I will call them, and I get them on board. And I can promise you that this will happen on Tuesday, June 2nd. I will still be calling places for people, and I will do it. The salons and beauty schools determine what services they will offer for free. It doesn't matter if you're a man or woman or what type of cancer you've battled. Anyone can sign up for the free services where there are spots available. The biggest reward for Grabshine wasn't a free service. It was walking into a salon full of cancer survivors just like her and connecting. I started to come here and I started to meet other people going through exactly what I was going through and even more. And being able to talk with women and just have a conversation about it was so healing. We provided a list of participating salons on our website, myfoxchicago.com. Just look for Barbara's story and you'll find a link to her website. Still